Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the React Redux Toolkit. So today we are going to learn about the combining multiple slices into a root reducer. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. So let's get started. Combining multiple slices into a root reducer is a common pattern in Redux, a popular state management library for the JavaScript applications. Okay, in Redux, you typically divide your application state into a smaller or more manageable pieces called slices. Each slice has its own reducer function that handle actions and updates the state specific to that slice. To create a root reducer, you will combine this individual slices reducers into a single reducer that represents the entire application state. Okay, so basically what the funda over here is, so here we have the features, right? First one is user, second one is to do, so third one is settings, right? So here you can see that we have a user slice, user profile. We, we have typically do that part, right? To do and this one. So here the main funda coming up here is, this is the user slice. So basic one, basic to do slice, okay? This is to do slice, right? This is setting slice, okay? So we have to the initial stage initial initialization state and the reducers part okay so here the come up the root reducer.js okay so here we are using the combined reducers right import combined reducers from redux and user reducer to do reducer and the setting reducers all the reducers we have we have calling over here okay they are all the slices okay so we're calling all the slices how to use that one so we have to define the root reducer combine reducers okay so we are combining all three reducers into one user reducer to do's and the settings okay into a export this as a root user okay then we are going to use this into a store.js okay so here we have a configure store then we are importing the root reducer and the store configure store reducer root reducer this is a that thing okay and the rest of the because previously we, what we are doing we are doing the single piece right so if i go in the previous one we have a store.js so here we are defining the rest um, whatever we have multiple you can come add multiple reducers over here right okay so but here you can see that we are combining into a one so here we here we are combining all the things right so here we are just combining the multiple slices we have reducers user to do's and the settings then we are calling into one config store part and then we, here we can use that one. So this is how we are able to do that part. Okay. So this is how any doubt, any query in that do let me know in the comment section. I think in the next video, you will get to know or clear clarity on that via the code level. We have already, I have already done with the help of the task manager or the to-do list, which is the next video. Okay. So any doubt, any query do let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.